Yeah. Hi there, guys. Um, basically, I just want to talk through um, my Nike video of how I talk about getting multiple users to enter into the draw. I just want to clear that up and the method to doing that. And I've also been getting some questions about a payment loop and this method of creating multiple Chrome users will actually help you solve that. So it's really important and it's um, a must for every release. And I've just got this picture up here of the Cactus Jack Jordans because these are the shoes I'm waiting for most this year. I'm a UK7. If anyone wants to hook me up, let me know. But I've also been getting a lot of questions about the Chrome extensions that I use. So I'll just take you through that. As well, I've replied to some comments given a direct link, but if you haven't seen them, here we go. You just type in Chrome Store in Google. It's this result here, and basically what extensions do is they add on to your Chrome for your chosen person, and they'll give you, you know, a new ability basically. So I've been getting some questions about what autofill I use. You just type in autofill, and it's this first one here for lightning bolt which obviously allows you to fill out information and save it so you don't have to fill it out again. And then I've been getting the most questions about my visual ping, which lets you monitor websites activity. It's this bottom one here called page monitor. That's the one I use. And of course it'll email you something if there's any change. And then another good one to get is called hotspot shield. Because when we're trying to get a lot of entries into the Nike draw, we want our IP address to be safe. We don't want them to catch us. So you're going to need um, a VPN or proxy, and this one's quite good. Um, it's free as well. And um, I don't think it's free forever, though. I think at some point you do have to start paying for it. But for now, it's all right, and we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Um, when it runs out for me, I'll look for a... Um, I'll look for a new VPN and I'll let you guys know, even if you have to pay something like five quid, five quid a month, I, I suppose it's worth it really. Um, so I'm just going to go through this multiple Chrome user thing, which basically is beneficial because it gives you new cookies, which makes it harder for, um, you know, websites to track you and it's better than just opening multiple tabs because that just gets you bland so basically how to do it is in the top right of your screen here it should say a name or a person mine says trainer talk uk what you're going to want to do is hit that and a drop down bar will come and basically you want to click on manage people and then it'll open up a new tab and in the bottom right it'll say add person so all you do is simply add a person call it whatever you want um you know call it person 99 999 if you want give it a little icon if you want and then press add and what that basically does is it opens up a new tab and then you have a brand new chrome user um and then you just repeat that process over and over again and you keep entering that them people into the draw. So we've talked about making multiple Nike accounts. So when you've for this specific Chrome user, you want to go to Nike.com, make account, get it verified, you know, order them free gift gaff sims um to get more numbers. So get that verified. Then once you've done one account on here open up a new chrome user you know open one up go over to nike.com repeat the process and make sure you go into the settings in nike.com and you fill out all the information so entering the draw literally takes 10 to 20 seconds and you want to do it as many times as your computer can hold it so that's for nike but also to tackle the issue of the payment problem i'm going to take you through it now so Pretend the off-whites restocked on Converse or whatever. And here, I've already done one in my cart just to save a little bit of time. So basically, pretend these are the off-whites or whatever. This is a shoe I want. I've got it in my cart and I'm pressing proceed to check out. And for whatever reason, it's not working. There's a loop. It's banned me. But 
I do have it in my cart. What I can do is, firstly, I should have signed in. You know, you should have logged in and then tried to cop. So pretend I'm logged in. I've got this in my cart, but there's a problem. All I simply do is open up a new Chrome user. And from that point, I go to converse.com. And then as long as I'm signed in, as long as I'm signed in, I should be able to cart it. And hang on, guys, it looks like there's a bit of a restock on the uh, off whites. So let's see what happens here. It says there's only 17. Oh, it must be quite old, that. I was getting a bit excited there, really. <laughs> um. So, yeah, pretend I've logged in. I've got that in stock. And then I've gone to a new Chrome user, checked in my car, and it should be there. And if you get the same problem, just repeat that process. That's all I want to talk about now, guys. Remember, check the Off-White website, there might be a potential restock. Check the Converse website, there might be a restock now. Let's go through it and see if there is. Just going to type in Off-White and see what happens. Um, I highly doubt there will be, but there's no harm in looking. Um, so, yeah, on the website it's actually sold out. Here's a stock list for it. Um... You know, I'm British, so we're mainly interested in the UK. So in London, here's the things that you can enter. Foot Patrol's a raffle, Ends a raffle, Pat is a raffle, Sneakers and Stuff is a raffle. They're all in-store pickup. Um, Selfridges, I think that's one through the Offspring Instagram account, and I've won that myself, so it's definitely worth entering. I've also won the Foot Patrol one. You know, the multiple um, raffle entries, that's how I got that one done. And yeah, that's all for now. Um, I hope it helps. Thank you for the mad views I'm getting. And all the comments and subscribers really appreciate it. Um, hopefully you enjoy this one too. You've learned something new. You can implement the things I've taught you. And hopefully you found it very useful and helpful. That's all for now. And I'll see you later.